what did you do to your boy, man? You know what? We're going to do it. I don't care how morbid my subscribers and uh, everybody tuning in to these episodes thinks I am. We're going in. We've got to sacrifice, man. The town people got to eat. I don't care if it's forearms and calves and thigh bones and derrieres. <laughs> you know, goodness. oh my gosh. Let's do it, bro. People say you can't get good help these days. Welcome back everybody, this is your boy Five Head. Welcome back to my channel. We're on another episode of We Happy Few, as you can see. The white face just kind of gave it away. They're over there slamming their drinks. I just slammed mine. My boy over there rubbing a daggone uh, hole in the... Well, hey man. <laughs> if you, uh, you know, probably had a guilty conscience. But anyways... Should have seen him over there, man. He's running the, he was rubbing the varnish off. He was rubbing it so daggone much. Anyways, man, we just dropped off my boy Ed. He had that compound fracture. They got him nice and uh, nice and cozy over there, all wrapped up. Check him out. Look at him. Gave him a little morphine. Look at him. He, he don't even know what's going on. Hey, buddy. Hey, how you doing? You doing all right, all right, all right. Now, I did talk to him and he just wants to know if I found Percy yet. So, I think I'm gonna be able to find Percy in this game. We ain't gonna talk about that one. Ooh, whoa, <laughs> my bad, Mia, my bad. Anyways, we're gonna come over here and we're gonna try to figure out what's going on with this heinous package. And we're gonna remove the possibly, remove the possibly heinous package. <clears throat> now this is the same cart in that one episode I think it's episode number 30 where that police officer was standing in it you remember me making fun of him yeah so well, I suppose they'll be rolling up the pavements about now okay good sister home it better than that please catch you lurking in the village Come on out what are you there. doing now? That's I got him, I got him. I got him. I'm out. What happened? That was so easy. That was so easy. Drop possibly heinous package. Stash the possible possibly heinous package in the ash cart behind the butchers. Oh, I gotta go clear across the deck on world. Oh, oh. Uh -huh. Where is it? At? Oh, okay, here it is. Oh no. Oh, I gotta go clear across the world, man. Hmm, dang it. Alright, so I'm gonna go ahead. Oh man. I don't I don't know. I don't know if we're gonna be able to get away with this. Cause we gotta we gotta avoid the cops. Oh no. Oh no, that's a long ways away, man. Or that that's a long way around. Okay, here we go. Hopefully this chick ain't tripping. I don't even know what it is. Hang on. Let's see what it is. Uh oh, -uh, it's a dead freaking body, bro. Oh. It's a dead body. I'm gonna get caught up for sure. Is he even tripping? He's not even tripping. Nah. You are not authorized. Please clear the area. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. I'm out. I'm out of here. No, nope. I'm out of here. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Look, he ain't even tripping. All good. All right, where are we going? Yeah, he ain't even tripping, man. We're just gonna go ahead and walk on through. I, I just I walked right up to the police officer. I just yanked it. Got up in there and yanked it. Dude, it's a dead body, yo. Mom never knew what to do about Percy. 
Except love him. She was good at that. Wonder what mask is. You know what it kind of reminded me of? The mask was a. Uh, I'll oh, shoot those old uh, diver masks. You know, with the glass, the big old metal dome and the glass. That's kind of reminded me of it first. Of course, I know it's not, but kind of what it looked like, man. It kind of threw me off. That and I was scared of getting caught. Hang on, man. Let's let, let, let's let's put him right here. I wonder if I should search him. Nothing. Damn. Look, that's a straight up dead body, yo. <laughs> Alright, come on, let's go. <whistles> Nothing to see here, guys. Nah, just, you know, delivering package. They don't even care. Man, right on. I was afraid we was gonna pick him up and have to. Seen close, I had to take advantage. <clears throat> Get those mechanical bits. Nah, we're good, we're good. You guys just chill out. Yeah, he, he dipped up underneath that TV, man. I had to pull out the old the old trunk in and lay him down. You know what I'm saying? I had to lay him down. Ain't nothing to see here. Just carrying a dead body. Nah, I'm, I'm not, not suspicious at all, see? Not suspicious at all. Excuse me there, Mr. Stevens. Hey, how you doing this evening there, Mr. Hunt? Yeah, just, you know, carrying, carrying a dead body. Just carrying a dead body. You know, they, uh, when, when you kill one of those things right there, since they're so high in the air, first of all, two, they're, they're easy to kill. Well, they were easy to kill when I hit them, but oh, that's the heinous package. I can store stuff on him because I'm literally in his inventory right now. That's strange. Anyways, um, yeah. So when so when you kill one of those guys, you should look. It, it's got a power cell and everything, dude. You should get all kind. Of, you, you should at least get advanced medical bit, uh, mechanical bits out of it. Not just mechanical. Nothing to see here, police. All right, I'll tell you what, man. Uh, this this ain't over yet. This stage ain't over. But I'll tell you what, it's a lot easier than what I thought it was gonna be. I thought for sure we was gonna have to um, fight all, our way all the way here. That's what this old that's what that old empty cart behind the pawn shop is or the meat shop. Uh -uh, I wonder if they're cutting him up. I wonder if they're cutting him up and serving him to people that are on joy. That's nasty, man. You take your joy Yo, that's nasty, dude. That's messed up, dude. You take your joy yeah, I know. Now I need a bed. <clears throat> See, it says, a large package, best be careful. Oops. Dude, I'm going to get five for that, bro. And then we're going to come over here and get... Uh... I want I want that one right there. Because I'm telling you what, once we get tech friendly... Game changing. Dang it, now I got to go to sleep. Okay, I'm telling you what, since we're over here, we might as well do it. Hey, it's working out. Let's let's go over here to this new shelter. 
that I've ran by multiple times, just never got into because I wanted to do it while I was recording. And this is, isn't this it? Yeah, this is it right here. Sit down for a bit. Check it out, man. This is the first time I've been up in here. Just want to make sure there ain't nothing there I can, I can get. It's over here. Okay, well, snitching TVs. All right, here we go. We might as well explore it. We're going to go ahead and explore this, man. We're going to get down there. We're going to go to sleep. Because Mr. Cuddy, his uh, meat shop isn't open until 7 a.m. So we're, we're going to go ahead and explore this. And then we're going to uh, sleep. We're going to sleep until 7. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Hopefully there's some good stuff in this chest. A canteen. One canteen. I got 40 of them. Probably more. Nothing. Ooh, search freezer locker. Mechanical bits and a light bulb. Huh, freezer locker. Yeah, man, I, I, I can't even, I don't even want to imagine what Mr. Cuddy's doing with that dead body. That is a body. All right, here we go. Entered, I think, this is number six. I think, shelter number six. And look at that, we can spend us some money, boy. What? I've already... I don't even need none of that. Just looking. Yeah, I'm just looking, I guess. All right, let's go ahead and check it all out first. All right, I got plenty of toll paper. Good, good, good. Because you know you're going to have to drop them deuces. I'm going to have to drop those deuces. That works. What is that book? Look at that rubber ducky in there. <laughs> check him out. A big old rubber ducky. Oh, yeah. AKA toilet paper. I gotta force this crate open. Yes, I know who I am and coffee beans. All right, sources of joy accumulate slightly slower in your system. Three of three, nice. Nice, very nice, man. I'm telling you what, we are. Dang it. I was hoping it wasn't joy. Papa joy. And life and noise of Papa Joy. Okay. Yeah, that withdrawal sucks. It's pretty good size. Okay, get that victory meat. Victory meat. Yes, pneumatic stash. Okay. Let's go ahead and um, man, we we haven't found no, no uh, dig spots for a while, so we're gonna go ahead and just move that since we don't need it. Okay, get rid of that and we're gonna get ourselves a little lighter here. We can only fill a maximum of three of the uh, empty canister, uh, the power cell canisters. So we'll just carry three just in case we run into it. Not, not really tripping on uh, getting, look at it, I got 37 full ones, 45 empty ones. That's just in my inventory. Okay. Doing good, doing good. Oh yeah, I can get rid of all that. I don't need all that. That's what's weighing your boy down right there. I'm gonna go ahead and get rid of that too. Now, didn't I have some military clothes? Sergeant's number two service dress. But where is my pants? 
Did I not get pants with it? I mean, I got pants with it too. I know I did. I will go ahead and get all that moved. I don't know. Anyways, all right, we're good there. There's my bed. Hansel, woke up in a cell made not of sugar, but iron bars and oak beams. Yo, man, it all seems so freaky. Okay, we've got a loose screw and some scotch. Very good. Pile of coins. How many was that, man? Let me know. It doesn't even tell me how many I got. Okay. Sweet. Okay. You know what? We might as well go ahead and upgrade this. Oh, it's... Whoa. Oh, yeah. I forgot I was still withdrawing. I was wondering why everything looked a little creepy. I'm like, what is going on? Gosh. All right, well, we might as well. We we might as well get back in this pneumatic stash. I do apologize, guys, but we're going to do this the right way. Oh, no. Not that. Do I not have... Oh, here it is. So this is just a workbench. We're going to go ahead and get that. Since this is our newest one, we're going to go ahead and spend it on this one. Okay. Not worried about crafting right now. We still need one for the chemistry set. Not a big deal. We can get back to that. Okay. What's back here, man? Multiline distribution. Oh, blue Molotov. What? What is that? <clears throat> oh, look at that, boy. <laughs> it's purple. It's got a, it's got a purple shade to the top right corner. Set a lot of things on fire at once. Set all targets aflame with long burning fire. Does damage over time and causes targets to flee. Dang. That's got to be late game stuff. I thought the green ones were late game stuff. No, 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 no. Nice, bro. We're going to go ahead and keep that. Let me see. Where is that? Oh, that ain't going to be there. Come on. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Come on. There it is. Now, hold on. Didn't I have a big shot grenade? Didn't I have a bigger shot grenade? Am I tripping? Hang on, man. I'm tripping. Hang on. I could have swore. Where's my pneumatic stash? Oh, it's right here. Didn't I have a bigger one? Man, I could have swore I had a bigger one. Let's look. In the weapons. No, it ain't in the weapons. It is going to be here. Oh, right here. Oh, the bo okay, so the bobby shot grenades have less damage. Oops. Than the regular shot grenades. The shot grenades are the bigger, better ones. Okay, so this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to keep the bobby ones. I'm going to keep the bobby ones on me. Yeah, that's that's cool. That ain't that, that ain't that much weight. <clears throat> oh man, I gotta go do some selling. Look at all these bottles. Sell all these goodies. Okay, anyways, I'm getting distracted. So let's see what it looks like. So there's your. Okay. Bigger banger. Okay. Bobby shocks and shocks. So the Bobby shocks are the weak ones. So we got to remember that whenever we're just messing around. Okay, let's go, man. I'm telling you, I'm getting distracted. Where is the hatch? I gotta, I gotta um, activate the hatch. Okay, that was the bathroom. All right, here we go. We're gonna activate the hatch. Good. Now 
I can come back here with the minimum of fuss. Mm -hmm. All right, let's go ahead and use. All right, check this out. We only got three more hatches left. Three more hatches. No. What? Hold on. Okay, so that's okay. I don't think it, it didn't even mark it. No, we got two more hatches left. Okay, so it's going to be here. There's going to be a hatch here. And then there's going to be a hatch up here. So we got two more hatches left because one of these unknowns is the one I'm at. All right, so we, we, we got that figured out. Sweet, man. Okay, let's go ahead and put that on the... Bobby Shocks. Okay, we, we gotta sleep. Okay, so we are good, man. We got this all figured out. Let's just go ahead and do a quick check, double check. Bathroom, got it all figured out. Okay, yes, yes, what? Yes. Okay, what rotors? I don't know what the rotors are doing there, but whatever. Maybe something... Maybe someone was fixing while they were pooping. Okay, this is what upsets me. I'm almost through this game. And I found a vending machine. And this is what it's selling me? Come on, man. I got $1,600. And this is all you're selling me? Come on. Okay, you got to give me a break here. All right, let's just make sure I'm not missing something here. Look around, look around, okay, yes, 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 good, good, mm-hmm, no, I want to sit, we do need to sleep, no, I want to keep on that radio, because that's my favorite jams, you know, that's good, okay, is there anything I can make? I gotta, I gotta make some mojo sometime, trainers, I think I'm good there, I got one available, it's 10. It takes 10 shredded raincoats. Okay, no, I'm good. Electro lock shockers, I got 23 available. I'm fine there. Plenty of crash syringes. A banger. That can make tons of bangers, man. Electric truncheon, I got 23 available. But the, the only bad thing is, is uh, the 23 is probably not all full, like full, full health. So that's okay. All right, bro, let's, let's sleep. Where, where'd my bed go? Here we go. My bed's right here. Hey, Teddy, don't, don't worry, daddy's coming. Okay, let's sleep till, let's just do this. Okay. Well, you've made your bed, Arthur. Yeah, because by the time we go to Cuddy's shop, man, it'd be good to go. We'll be good. We're going to go ahead and save that game right there. I'm not going to worry about that triple that, that triple save, you know, like your boy like your boy likes to do, just in case. We're going to go with that one, skis, because it's time to go, man. we got to go figure out what's up with this dead body, bro. We, you know what I'm saying? Like like boys in the hood. Y'all want to see a dead body. Because you know I got you. Oh, give me that bottle. Shoot, that's a dollar. You know what I'm saying? That's how you got to look at that trash. That's a dollar. Okay, where are we going? We are going to the meat shop. Okay. Do, do, do. Do, do, do. All right, five minutes. See, I told you, man. That's a dead body. You know what? You're going to calm that down. There it is. It just opened up. Okay, I cannot wait to get that. This right here. Say so they quit. Trying to shock me all the time. All right, hey, you opened up. How can I help you? Well, sir, I'm here to 
talk. Arthur Hastings, you are an intrepid young man. You've done me a solid. They don't make them like you anymore. You ain't lying. Well, we suppose they don't make them at all anymore. <laughs> Here, the least I can do is give you what I gave you. Three dollars? Look, my job has been getting complicated. You got $3 I could start me using an apprentice. Would you like a permanent position? Wakey, <laughs> wakey, everyone. Good morning to you. Hey, man, I got some fat I'd like to sell you. I'd like to sell you all this fat around my belly. Anyways, I want to see what you got, bro. I want to, I want to barter. What you oh. fancy? Two inventory. What? Two shop. How much would you sell me for this? Eight. Hey, come on, bro. So you got a hundred and eighty dollars, but I can't get it. Oh no, no, no! I'm, I'm tripping. You don't have nothing to buy, is what I'm thinking. Dude, electric trunching is worth more than that blue Molotov. Nice to see you. Yeah, nice seat, bro. You got back here. Edmund's a good lad, but he's always been a bit limited. And my work has become so challenging of late. I've had to go to extraordinary measures to keep this tank fed. We are in an extraordinary situation, aren't we? You were so helpful in bringing me that package. Now, we need to process it. You want me to help? process that package i'm not proposing you hurt anyone you understand just ignore a silly old taboo just go on through that door if you're willing to help oh no I can't oh no considering this maybe i should just walk out and report into the police oh yo rick you have to eat though oh, no. all right maybe man i don't know one shoes I, I don't know what's going on here. Well, I, I, I do. I just don't know why. Okay. So this is the thing. This is the mission. It, it, it's it's a it, it's a dead body. He wants me to chop it up so he can serve it to the town's people. And that's the V-meat, man. That's the mystery meat. I don't, I don't think I've eaten mine yet. I got V-meat. Now I know what it is. Oh. oh no, door of morbid acceptance. So we're gonna have to chop we're gonna have to chop up a dead body, man. Hold on, man. Uh hold on. See look, I told you I ain't I ain't, I ain't ate mine. Oh, this is gross. Hang on, man. I was looking at something. We got six. Oh, I need eight. Should I? Should I just get that? I don't know, man. I really want this. Oh, no. <laughs> don't know right now. Oh, Reggie Cuddy, man. What'd you do to your boy? Oh. It is a side mission, though. It ain't a story quest. Oh, man. What did you do to your boy, man? You know what? We're going to do it. I don't care how morbid my subscribers and um, everybody tuning in to these episodes. Thanks, I am. We're going in. We've got to sacrifice, man. The town people got to eat. I don't care if it's forearms and calves and thigh bones and derrieres. <laughs> you know, goodness. Oh my gosh. Let's do it, bro. <laughs> People say you can't get good help these days. Uh, I was going to help you, bro. Ow. Oh, I smell oh. things. I'm naked. Oh no. No windows. Oh, it's not ominous at all. Oh no. Welcome to Cutty's Mechanical Kitchen, featuring the very latest in meat packing technology. 
It used to take days to dismantle a carcass. With my new inventions, one apprentice can reduce a carcass to its edible parts in no time at all. I hope you're as excited as I am. This is the very first time we're running our machines on the real... Until... What have I got myself into? Now, the first thing that I need you to do is obtain the package from the upstairs cold storage room. Don't worry. At no point will you have to unwrap the package. The magic all happens through the provided access valve. Dang it. And this music better not be copyright, man. YouTube, you know I can't help this. I'm not smart enough to glitch all that out. Oh, man. Let me look at this picture. Oh, oh, uh, oh. Uh. I'll take it off. I don't have nothing. He stole all my stuff. Oh no, I can't believe I'm doing this. Okay, I thought we were gonna have to go through that. Um Wow, what have I gotten myself into? Oh no. <laughs> Hold on, let me search all this. Oh no, what have I Oh Please don't be copyright. Uh oh. Okay, we got we no we, we, we got to read. read. Now. What do you mean? No time to read this now. Oh, I gotta go get them. Oh man. First, we must exsanguinate the package. Bring it downstairs to the exsanguinator. The what downstairs? Oh my gosh, dude. No time to read this now. Well, let me read it. It might be giving me a way out of this thing. Oh my gosh. Oh, look at the picture. <laughs> oh, Nicola, it's a woman. Uh uh. Yo, dude, you are, uh, you are something else, bro. I don't even know what to do with you. Oh, no. No time to read this now. Come on, man, let me get Cuddy's journal. Yo, let me get that honey, man. Thank you. Oh no, this is not good. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to use that. I'm definitely gonna have to use that toilet or that uh tub here in a little bit. Oh my gosh, that's his great grandfather. A yam was in the fire? Oh no, no, no. Oh, I'm tired of looking at I'm tired of looking at uh pictures of meat on the wall. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna shut you off, man. Can I shut you off? Man, YouTube, you better not screw me on no uh on no copyrights, man. I can't I can't help all that, man. I'm I'm trying to get rid of dead bodies. Come on, man. Let me search that. Let me search this. Oh, me, can I search this? Nah, I guess not. Oh. This is very morbid. Very morbid. How far do I have to go with this thing? That's cool. You're gonna quit showing me pictures of sausages. Oh, you're making me feel all weird, bro. Yeah, what is that? Hang on. 
Drop you. Spare as fair Vader part. Whatever. Yes, I need that. Come on. He clearly wants me to stay away from the cellar. Is that the way out, I wonder? I'm about dead. And I'm tired. He said take it downstairs. Where am I supposed to go with it? Hang on. Where did he say he wants me to, ha to hang this package on the... Oh, okay. Sorry, I did. I, I did pass that. I do apologize. Oh, here he is. Before you make the package, you'll need to operate each machine once, just to clear out any residue and check its operational soundness. We don't want to contaminate the product. Contaminate the product? That's what you're worried about, bro. <laughs> Join the package to the exsanguinator via the provided access valve. Uh, which is where? Let's go back upstairs. Hang on, man. What's all this? Okay. <laughs> Sorry, man. I'm thrown off a little bit by what's going on here. I'm, uh... Hopefully, I just get in trouble for a, um, uh, mutilating a dead carcass. Not so much the murder part of it. Okay, it says right here. Oh, here we go. Now, turn the crank until the exsanguinator determines that the package no longer contains free liquids. We don't want anything to go to waste, do we? Uh, oh, you are, you are a very sick man, dude. <laughs> ah, good. As you can see, each machine will release this package once it's accomplished its purpose. Efficiency is our watchword. Next up, evisceration. That would be the, the eviscerator? You learn quickly. As before, engage the mechanism briefly to verify mechanical integrity. <laughs> oh my gosh, I can't believe what I'm doing right now. Oh man, I cannot believe what I'm doing right now. <clears throat> well, definitely don't want to search it for any liquids. Because those are gone. Oh no. Was it supposed to do that? Did you not see the blades come out? No, just, just sparks. Also, a, a metal thing just fell out of the main bit. Oh dear. The commutings were overloaded again. I thought we'd fix okay, that. Repair it. Maybe you better come down here and fix it again. Ha! Uh, I'm sure you can manage on your own. There's a spare one in the cupboard downstairs. There's only one way to insert it. It's in! There we go! Try the button again. I really don't want him around me. I mean, you know what I'm saying? Reggie Cutter. I thought he was just a butcher. Like, butching cows. <sighs> Not like this. Oh, no. Good as new. Well, it's actually quite new, so, you know. Anyway, we're back in action. You can attach the package now. This is very disturbing, guys. I do apologize for the disturbing scenes. If there are any, anybody under the age of 17, do not, and I repeat, do not watch this. Well mounted, lad. Well mounted. Excellent! When the eviscerator is done, the package will be dismounted, ready for another package. Uh, another package? Once I achieve a steadier stream of raw material, I would have to keep these machines running all day. Or at least long enough to take advantage of any surplus 
protein that could be obtained in Wellington Wells. Oh my gosh, dude, this is... <sighs> now for the final process. Bring oh. the package to the exfoliator on the next floor. Exfoliator? Yep. <sighs> it exposes the skin to steam, separating it from the muscle. And then it removes the skin, making it available for tanning. Or other purposes. I, I don't mean to be impertinent, but shouldn't you do that first? Oh, no, no. There are no stupid questions, only stupid answers. But that will result in a leakage of liquid. And you won't want to put it second either, because the package is much easier to manipulate with its skin on. That I'm so is... glad I asked. On with the exfoliator! Press the button, check the functional integrity, and so vita! I, I mean, and so forth! This is very disturbing. Oh my gosh. I just know I'm gonna lose all kinds of subscribers. Oh, you, you guys better not run off. Don't you run off. I didn't know this was gonna happen. We gotta, you know, we, we gotta do what we gotta do, though. <laughs> oh my gosh, that was disturbing. Oh, where, hold on, what are we doing? Uh, can I, can I go take a quick bath, please? Uh, um, yeah, I gotta go take a quick bath, please, pretty please. Alright, here we go. Oh, past the, oh. Um, so it sounds like my boy Reggie, <clears throat> my boy Reggie getting his, his kicks off with this. <clears throat> oh my gosh. Hang on. Y'all, y'all gotta hang on. I better, I, I better not see my subscriber count fall because of this. I want to see it raise up. Okay. And before we exfoliate this package. I need you guys to hit that thumbs up, man, and subscribe to this channel. This is weird and awkward, man. This is this is disturbing. <laughs> it's disturbing me right now. Yes, yes, yes. And do turn on them bell notifications, man. <whistles> this is something else. Okay, here we go. We are going to do our thing. We got to test it first. Oh my gosh. Superb! The package will be released once it's fully exfoliated. Do you think exfoliator is the right word? I thought about decorticator, but it's <laughs> sanguinate, eviscerate, exfoliate. Has a nice ring to it, doesn't it? Definitely exfoliate. I'm so glad to hear that. I mean, it's a scalder, skinner, but that doesn't sound very official, does it? And the last machine is the extruder. Is the extruder. My man is getting seriously off on this, bro. All right, come on, let's exfoliate. <clears throat> Guys, we're just... is now fully prepared. We're ready for the extruder. Mind the package and let's get cracking. Oh, oh I can barely contain myself. I this is really that. the machine I'm proudest of. It's a combination meat grinder, pulper, and injection mold meat former. You wouldn't believe what I had to go through to get the pieces. This is disturbing. I am afraid to hit the X button and search this thing. <clears throat> oh no. <laughs> Over here I'm going to have to hit some buttons. I already know what that is. Select a stencil. <clears throat> oh no. Okay. 
Alright, we gotta test it first. Oh, so you don't have to test this one? Okay. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and mount this. Oh. Oh my god. <clears throat> Up on my board, you'll see a list of orders. They've already filled in the addresses. All you have to do is press the right button. For example, if the order calls for one meat loaf and one meat butt cake, then you press the appropriate button and then you put the order in a pneumatic tube. Okay, hold on. He said something about what now? Hold on. Oh, that is disturbing, dude. I'll talk to with this now. Oh, that is disturbing. Oh, that is horrible. <laughs> okay, but what, but how do we do, how, what, where's the list? What list, bro? Hang on. How do I know what list? What's this? Yeah, where's my list? Didn't he say something about a list? Oh, that is disturbing. <laughs> All right, let's do uh, button. Um, hang, hang on, hang on. I want to make sure I'm doing this right. Oh, pack that meat. Make sure the big machine room. Okay. Yeah, I've definitely lost my appetite forever. Oh, I see, I see, I see. It's right there. Oh, that is horrible. Uh, I think I've done it wrong. <laughs> Work! Now, put the order in the hopper. see it. It's right there. I didn't know, bro. Chill out, man. I, I definitely don't want to be his next victim. So I got I to do this the right way. Blue, orange, red, orange. Come on, hurry up. I gotta freaking get out of here. This guy's freaking me out. And I'm, I'm sitting here naked. I got one raw meat on me. That's it. Okay. That is terrific. We have a feeling this is the beginning of a beautiful friendship. No. Never. Never. I, I, I feel like Ed, Ed, I feel like I'm being instructed by Ed Gein. Y'all don't know Ed Gein? Look him up. No, 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 no. Come on! Just... Don't doodle! That just shocked me. Okay, we gotta go green, red, red, red. How many of these do I gotta do? I don't I don't know. You're a smart lad! Speed it up! I'm very impressed. Okay, blue, green, orange, orange. This is disturbing. Why am I getting hit? 
I want you focusing on the job. This is no time to date, isn't it? An amazing system. Okay. We're quite Green, quite red, to orange, red. Green. Where am I going? Green, red, orange, red. Yo, you keep shocking You're me, man. Smart lad. Speed it up. I can only go so fast. Ed. That's what it is. That's that's Ed Gein all day. Oh, come on. Deliver. You're doing well. And doing good, too. Okay, orange, blue, green, green. Bit that button as fast as I can, yo. Come on, hurry up. Ah, I'm getting shot. Come on, don't dawdle. I'm not dawdling. I wish we had more butchers. I could start franchising. Why don't you get some rest? I bet we filled twice as many orders tomorrow. I've got to find some way out of here. Okay, take a break. Plan a daring escape. Okay. I need to grab this. You're okay. very good at justifying yourself. Uh, I suppose you learned that during the war. What are you talking about? I found your letter. You were a child then. You wouldn't understand. Oh yes, it was a happy, carefree time for us kids. I loved her. We were just two young people caught up in something bigger than ourselves. Well, that doesn't sound like what the home army's onto you about. I'm you don't sure. understand. I thought it would stay forever. I had to sell meat. We had to get on. I suppose we all made our sacrifices. Have you done nothing that you regret? Or is it just that you have all your regrets neatly wrapped up in brown paper so you can pretend that you don't know how they got there? I'm going to burn your I place down. At least I look the blood and the flesh and the bone. At least I remember. I'm going to burn your place down if I can. I'm going to take this blue Molotov and throw it on you, bro. You're gross. Okay, I gotta get out of here, man. I don't have no health. Oh, man, no gad. Oh, I do. To choke. Stamina boost. Said get some rest. Where do I. Okay, there was one other thing I had to. Okay, I think it's downstairs. There's one other thing I had to get, which is downstairs. I'm getting out of here, dude. This is freaking me out. This is freaking deep, boy. Um, there was... Here it is. Yes. August 30th. Have to be more careful. I accidentally put my hat next to the suction coupling, and it went right into the intake canister. Spent an hour pulling felt off the blades in the cyclone mincer. Imagine if that had been a bottle, or worse, a wrench. September or your 9th. head. Problem solved. Added a power cut off to the suction coupling. Now it won't even start up unless a package is mounted onto it. I'm going to add that same cut off to all the machines to minimize accidents. Don't want Edmund's hand ending up in the V-meat. Ah, if I stuff that broken bit of the eviscerator into the package, it ought to clog up the works nicely, shouldn't it? Oh, right. You. <clears throat> Are you ready Ed. for another day of serving people? I mean, uh, that's Ed, Ed Gein, man. <laughs> My little cheek. Never mind. All right, come on. Sabotage the extruder. I need, I need health. Okay, the extruder. Um, okay, the extruder is upstairs. Okay, in here. Hold the sabotage. Let's see what's true. That. Uh huh. Uh huh. Yes. Something's gone terribly wrong. There's smoke coming out. That doesn't seem good. The bad come down. Don't yeah, come down, Ed. Clever. You've got a lot to do today. And it takes too long to recover from the spanker. Yup. That right there is Ed Gein all day long, bro. Um, it's right here. I don't, I don't get out through here. No. You. Oh, I'm a, I'd like to choke you out. Can I choke? Okay, okay. Oh! Ow. Oh, no. I 
shouldn't have punched him. All right. Are you ready for another day of serving people? I mean, uh, serving the people, of course. <laughs> My little cheek. Uh, Never mind. I thought I, I thought I lost it. <laughs> what the? I just. What did I see? Did you guys see that? Dang it! I gotta go down here and find this part. Um. No, I thought if I punched him, I'd be able to take him out. It didn't work. Where was that? Ouch! I want you focusing on the job. I'm trying. This I'm is trying. no time to daydream. Yes, sir. Sorry, I was just daydreaming. Where did I see that? At? Smart lad, speed it up. Is it upstairs? Can I even go upstairs? No, I can't go upstairs. What? Okay, I'm not trying to dawdle. Where do I find that part at? Where was that part at? Oh no. I want you focusing on the job. This is no time to daydream. I have to do this again. Surely I don't have to do it again. It just says to sabotage. You're a smart lad. Red, Speed red. it up. Orange, red, green, red. Well, let's see. Job. This is no, isn't it an amazing system? Where's We're quite that? proud of all the automation. Man, okay, I guess I'm gonna have to go through this again. Red, orange, green, red. I shouldn't have punched him. I shouldn't, I shouldn't have punched him in the back of the head, man. I think. Sir, I'm not dog. I wish they had more butchers. I could start franchising. Orange, red, red, green. This time I won't punch him in the back of the head. Yeah, Set him on fire. I'm very impressed. Uh, orange, blue, green, orange. Come on. I want you. Sir, I'm trying. You're gonna, you're gonna have to put shock me, no man. I can't focus. You're doing well and doing good too. Okay. Now, where's this thing? You're doing a lovely job. Why don't you take a short break and get something to eat? Thank you. 
Where's the eviscerator part? The eviscerator part. I don't, I don't have it no more for some reason. Where's the eviscerator? Am I overlooking it? <laughs> My little chick. Never mind. starting to get really annoying. Where is that part at? I don't want to do this no more. Where is that part at? Come on! Don't go Okay, this is starting to get annoying. I need to sabotage it, but I don't know where the part is. What happened here? What? What is that? Ow. Okay, come on. This is getting a little ridiculous here. All right. Are you ready for another day of serving people? I mean, no. uh... Serving the people, of course. <laughs> My little chick. <laughs> no, I would like to get up out of here. Where is... Oh, here it is. Thank you. Didn't look over on the floor. Didn't expect it to be on the floor. Uh, it's um, it's doing that smoky grindy thing again. That doesn't seem good. I better I'd come down. Don't try anything clever. No, I won't this time. Got a lot to do today, and it takes too long to recover from the spanker. La, 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 la. Hey, how you doing? I'm just gonna come down and use the bathroom real quick. I mean, by the bathroom, I mean run out your front door. Surely he left the door open. Yes. I think cover I'll just get my things and go. Oh, that's a rat. Heavens. This is clogged up something proper. Princess to the extruder room, please. A princess to the extruder room. No, I'm good. Uh -uh. Michael Cutting. Heavens, this is clogged up something proper. No, oh, man, this ain't right, dude.
Are you skulking about somewhere? Where do I go? Ah. I don't see anyone else's things here. Yes. That's a good sign. You're not in the center, are you? Hello, I must be going. Yeah. What can I do you for today? Oh, there he is. There he is. He don't see me. I'm gonna tear his butt up, dude. This has been very disturbing. I am blinded for life. Okay, okay. Oh, oh no! Heal, heal! I didn't heal myself. Oh no! No. Okay. Are you ready for another day? Yeah, gone, guys. I'm sorry, man. No, no, we ain't doing this no more. Come on, let me let me let me go ahead and get. Oh yeah, let me go ahead and sabotage that. Man, I should have healed. Oh. Oh, we're gonna get it this time. It's um, it's doing that. Smoky grindy thing again. We're gonna get That's it this time, man. Good. We're gonna get on up out of here. Don't try anything clever. This is ridiculous. To it oh. takes too long to recover from the spanker. Dang it. See ya. No, I'm getting up out of here, man. No, we ain't gonna do this no more. No more mess ups, bro. No more mess ups, five head. All right, I know where my stuff is. Don't worry about it. The freezer locker, where's the freezer locker? You're not in the center, are you? Okay. Goodness, you survived your mission. Ouch! No! No! Come on! Ow! Okay, as soon as I get my stuff. All right. Are you ready for another day of serving people? As soon as I get my I stuff, know. man, I got to people, uh, <laughs> run, I guess. My little I, I tried to heal. Even healing wasn't working. Oh, here we go. Dang uh, it. It's, um, it's doing that smoky, grindy thing again. That doesn't sound good. The better I'd come down. Don't try anything clever. Man, I'm out of here, bro. to do today. Uh, it takes too long to recover from the spanker. Oh, come on. I guess it don't matter. As soon as I grab my stuff, though, it's on. I... I'm trying to figure out how to get away from that shocking thing. As soon as I grab my stuff is, is when it's on. Now, where is... Where do I go? There's a spanker. Dumb thing! Do I hide? Why is there a workbench? Don't wander off! I'll need you as soon as I have this up and running again! Okay, hang on. I, I, gotta, I gotta look at this over. So do I come in here? Dumb thing! Dude, they're all over the place. Oh my gosh. You're not in the center, are you? I should fancy to die. What can I do you for? I I don't I don't understand. Do I, do I, okay, I don't get it because Ow. I get hit right off. Oh man, it's starting to get annoying now. All right, are you ready for another day of serving people? I mean, uh, no, I'm sick and tired of this level. Of course. <laughs> My little chip. Hey, hey, my little chip. I'm sick of it. Okay, he's he's by the ladder. Uh, it's um, it's doing that smoky grindy thing again. 
That doesn't sound good. Okay, he he's by the ladder, coming. and that's where he's I think I gotta go. Clever. We've got a lot to do today, and it takes too long to recover from the spanker. Um. So as soon as I grab my stuff, then it's it's on. But he's there by the ladder. And I cannot kill him. Are you skulking about somewhere? Before I was over here. I really don't know where to go. I really don't. Apprentice to the extruder room, please. Uh, you're not in the center, are you? Okay, hold on, hold on, guys. Hang on. Wonder if there's a way. I was thinking maybe there was something here that will help me get out. What's going on up there? Yeah, you had to get down there, bro. I heard shouting. Where's Rich? Yeah, you down. Mr. Cutty's turning cadavers into V-meat. I barely escaped becoming V-meat myself. He's got these horrible machines in there that turn people into meat bunt cake. Uh, human bunt cake? That's, that's monstrous. Is right. he armed? He has a rather nasty spanker, but I think he's a bit trapped in the cellar at the moment. Right. We'll knock out the power. Go spank him ourselves. Yeah. Thank I'm you, right. citizen. We'll take it from here. Yeah, you are. You can't do this to me! I'm a pillar of the community! It's all lies! I never! Those are all perfectly legitimate machines! I'm only trying to feed people! We're letting perfectly good meat go rotten! That's insane! That is nasty, dude. Should give thought to becoming a vegetarian. That was nasty. How many points did I get? Five skill points. Uh. Man, that was insane. That was insane, man. I'm not going to lie. That one took a while, man. Guys, I, I do apologize. I didn't realize that... If he seen you, if 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 Reggie seen you, then you got shocked. See, I was wondering why I didn't get shocked when he didn't see me at first, but then I started running and trying to beat him up and died. Yes, that's that, that that's how you get out of there, man. You got to stay away from him. You got to stay incognito. So if you guys ever play this, avoid being seen by Reggie. Find the ladder. You're out. Ooh. Okay, here we go. Tech friendly. Spankers, peepers, and jubilators take longer to detect you. That's where we're going to go, bro. Dang. We're trying to get backstabber. 10, 10, 8. See, I don't, I don't really throw objects. This one be huge. We're going to go ahead and get this one right there. 
we're gonna get that one right there man we've got four more left and i'm telling you what boy we will be on top of our game doing our thing you guys like subscribe and turn on the bell notifications man to get this boy's content five head gaming man thanks for tuning in it's been real guys peace out